Hey guys, this is Abhishek here. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to discuss about uh, transparent huge page memory. So how we can configure in the host level. Okay. So I logged in one of the machine. Okay. So this is running with uh, RHL 7.7. Okay. So I am using sent OS. Okay. So actually the transparent huge page memory is a uh, uh basically used for the applications okay so by default it will be enabled okay and you can set the certain values in uh, 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 kernel parameters okay so kernel parameters location is etcctl.com in that file you can uh, allocate a uh, huge page memory okay so if application team is using uh, like a different value apart from the system one so you could or you can disable the host level because the oracle will play a role like a different way like uh, it will not match with the os uh, configured transfer to each page memory value and it will not support to that so they will ask support team to give uh, some certain value in the etcctl.com file so which will conflict at the booting level and uh, it will your system may crash actually so again you need to disable it and rebuild the uh, kernel parameters uh, i mean grub file okay so uh, where you need to configure it so the default grub file will be located under etc etc default grub okay so this is the file where you could find the uh, all the configuration related to grub so just i will cat it so here you could see the grub timeout and distributor default disable menu in the similar manner there is one line grub command line linux okay so in this line you need to add your transmit huge space memory uh, parameter set to never okay so whenever it boots it will set to that okay so currently it's not configured here so you need to write here that uh, transfer huge page huge page memory equal to huge page equal to never okay so just edit this go to never okay so after adding this you need to rebuild the rebuild the grub okay so how you will rebuild grub to ifn mk config ifn o the grub file will be located under boot okay grub to and grub dot conf and cfg file okay so then run it okay now it's configured okay just validate okay so to validate the use page whether enabled or disabled just do cat says kernel mm transfer use mesh enabled so it will show whether it's enabled or disabled so it's enabled so it's saying that always so which means that it's enabled okay so already we added it so and uh, we rebuild the uh, grub file as well okay just one more time validate the the file whether it has the transparent use page equal to never okay you shouldn't make any um, characters error 
okay just make sure that you are using correct transparent underscore use page equal to demo okay so now uh, now we need to remove the system to apply the changes okay so once we reboot uh, it should give us the uh, never value here so it's showing as always it should enter into never okay and one more method to view is cat slash proc and cmd line okay so even this will show the transparent huge page equal to never okay now it's not showing anywhere okay if you observe okay so i will reboot now and let's see the value i'm rebooting okay it disconnected so let's go to the console and monitor it okay it's it's a booting now i think it's booted now you start it okay now check the cat proc cmd line okay you can see here it's applied that's it so now you can use the sap or volatile team can give you the um, additional transparent huge page values you can add it under the etc.conf from my side hope you enjoyed the session thank you